Guys, uh, Jason here. Um, haven't done a metal detecting video for a couple, two or three weeks because it's been super hot. And I uh, just kind of wanted to do a uh, garden update video. But it's so windy, as soon as I step out past this wall here to show you guys, you won't be able to hear me. So let's just bear with it and I'll just show you what I got going on. Uh, I planted all this by seed except for the jalapenos and the flowers but anyways let's check it out maybe you guys will be able to hear me but anyways let's go so it's a kind of a small one either way there's some corn planted from seed that one was very small don't know what the deal is with it but it's growing it's got a lot of suckers all these got like three or four suckers growing on them uh, tomatoes I got they're blooming no tomatoes yet, but soon. I think next time I'm just going to buy them from the store because it's a, like two months I've been doing this. And I still haven't done the show for you. Anyways, here's one of the corns. I'm trying to prop it back because they lean out away from the wall for some reason. And they're covering up my pepper plant I got under here. Got no peppers on this one yet. But it's gotten quite tall. Um, the other tomato. I got four tomatoes out here. They're either home, homestead, or select. I don't know which one. I just picked out the good ones that were grown in the seed tray and planted them. Here's one of the coriander's that I planted inside. Yeah, great, but it's not dead, so that's a good thing. Uh, here's the other pansy. Bought from the store, doing good. This one's doing all right too. Anyways, uh, the other pet, the other uh, tomato. Um, block this wind because it's just man hot and windy too hot for metal detecting too windy for video and yeah this corn plant's doing pretty good I just can't wait till they get real tall anyways uh, here's the other tomato right, this, corn, this pepper plant has got a uh, pepper on it well all over and then uh, this is the other pans he doesn't like it he's hating life grown all deformed and stuff it's kind of weird so the corn plant I got going and here's the cilantro I planted directly in the ground from seed it's doing very well uh, I'm liking that one and I got a couple uh, seeds I threw in underneath Got a couple more grown over by that other corn plant at the end. And I just threw seeds in randomly and see what would happen, and they're growing too. So, yeah, I'll be able to make me some uh, some salsa someday. Anyways, uh, just want to let you guys know that <clears throat> have been metal detecting because it's been so hot and like nobody likes to be out with headphones on, sweating and dripping sweat and digging in dirt. And uh, maybe I need to go earlier in the mornings or later in the evenings but yeah I've just been taking a little break and uh, relaxing on the weekends instead of like six almost five months straight every weekend heading out there trying to find some stuff I just need a little break because it's getting kind of hot anyways anyways I just want to show you guys my uh, update of my little garden and uh, hope you guys enjoy and, and until the next video Happy hunting, happy gardening, and until uh, next time, see you then, and uh, thanks for subscribing, and if you haven't subscribed, subscribe. Anyways, talk to you later. Bye. Hey guys, it's Jason here. I um, want to show you a little update on my garden. I know it's been like, what, six weeks since I put out a little detecting video because it's really windy and really hot right now and so uh, I just want to show you a little update on my garden. So here we go. Okay, there's my
my corn plant. One of them has gotten a lot bigger since you guys have seen it last. Here's uh, my uh, Jesus cilantro in the background there. That thing's gone to seed uh, really quick. So pretty much once it does that, all the uh, the clippings you take off it, it's going to taste like uh, flowers. Basically, right now it's a uh, the bottom leaves are good, and I got a couple small ones coming up underneath there that decided to come up late. Got uh, my tomato plants that are doing tomatoes right now. They're not very big yet, and these don't seem to be coming out very big. still ripe, but we'll see. Corn plants. There's two more tomatoes there, and I planted all this by seed, except for this pansy here, which is hating life. It's all withered. You know, it gets plenty of water. The deal is just up until a week ago, these had flowers. I think they're going through a second blooming, but that's another pansy. I got one over there, I'll show you in a minute. Um, I harvested several jalapenos off of these. And as a matter of fact, let's see if we can't show you guys. I got a good fat one sitting back here. Let's see if we can't see it. Well, I don't know, maybe. Let's see. I've harvested several off of this one and the other one already. They're pretty hot. Um, these tomatoes over here are doing a little, a little fatter than the other ones. I planted two separate kind of species, homestead and select. I don't know which ones these are. Like I said, I just uh, picked out the best ones that were growing the best and, you know, try to plant them outside. Here's another one. Here's uh, the corn, the other one. Here's this one. It's finally starting to do tomato. And I started these like three months ago. I don't know if I started too early or what, but you know. Let, live and learn. Next time, I think I'm just going to buy all my stuff like I used to do from the garden center. Here's the piggy plant, which is already starting to tassel. Can you see down there? I can't. But there's a tassel coming. Maybe, yeah. And here's the first ear. Right there. So, oh man, I got baby cilantros growing up all around here. Because I threw them in there just to see what would happen. And that's what happens. They pop up. And those will make you know, second harvest, third harvest, whatever. And here's the other uh, pansy. Not as bad as the others, but they look all stunted. The new growth is all stunted and twisted. It's kind of weird. I don't it, but whatever. So, anyways, they're tasseling. This one maybe what two and a half, two and a half feet. It's already starting to tassel. This one's three feet. It's starting to tassel. Same thing with all of them. They're tasseling. I don't see any signs of ears on this one. Uh, I do see an ear coming up right about there on this one, and it's this tassel is about to bust out the top here. Anyways, uh, I just thought I'd give you guys an update on my garden, let you know it's been really hot up here, down here in Arizona, and it's, it makes it kind of hard to film and make metal detecting videos, especially when you're just sweating your face and you're dripping sweat. It's not a very fun thing. Hoping for a couple of cool days coming up here soon because I really need to get out and start metal detecting again because I'm missing it bad. Got the itch. Um, anyways guys, here's my garden. It's cramped because it's all the space I got, but I'm doing the best with what I got. Until next time, happy hunting, happy gardening.
Uh, thanks for subscribing. Thanks for watching my videos. And until next time, hopefully, which is soon, uh, talk to you again. Bye. Huh.